always, I always do this one just for the. Oh! Hello and welcome to this brand new video for Valentine's Day. My name is Robotic Master. Today we have the luxury of having a look of a brand new Zook that I made using the Zook kit. I did attempt to do a video of me creating this Zook, however when I stopped recording the video, the video crashed. So we don't have any footage of me uh, making this Zook, however we do have footage, we can have footage of me testing the Zook via the 5 disciplines inside this tool. Cupid's arrow is des is one of these zooks that is designed in the mind of hitting zooks with a dr love potion that is sent to make them fall in love with the person they next lay their eyes onto, fired by Cupid himself. It has about it has 16 legs and is a very nice size, but let's give it a test run. Starting off with a sprint which tests the fastest zooks. Let's go. It is a grand total of whoa, 133 m.6 centimeters a second, which is actually pretty quick. Also completed that at 1.5 seconds, which is also very impressive. Time for the block push. In this discipline, it's got to push these blocks as far as it can. This Zook is not designed really for strength. It is more designed for speed and agility which is what it's kind of showing off here but right now it's not even moving it's just sprinting at the wall pushing that 15.4 centimeters which isn't actually that far but it's a very nifty zook and it's now time for the zook hurdles it's going to sprint along here and due to the power of the zook oh wow that's beautiful it, it does in 120.6 centimeters which is pretty awesome time for a high jump let's see how high it can jump i'm not expecting this to jump high but it's always, I always do this one just for the, oh yeah, I wasn't expecting that, that was pretty awesome, down, down, zook down, zook down, I didn't count a jump, but what a wipeout, oh, I love wipeouts, oh, poor zook, now time for lap, let's see how quickly it will complete this contest, it goes to the first corner and spins out, however, very quick recovery, it's on to the next point, spins out a little bit more, uh, it's kind of stuttering a bit, but it gets to the third point. Whoa, look at that. It's very speedy. It's going to turn around and miss the point. Oh, I have to do that again because it didn't officially record the time. See if it's going to do the same thing again. It's sprinting time. It goes to the first point and it spins around. It's going to go to the second point and it spins around. It spins around a little bit more, but it's still kind of somewhat in point. Because it's then going to go there. It's then going to go here. Oh, man, it missed again. But that was around about just over 10 seconds, I imagine, if it gets this accurate. Third try. Let's see. Let's see how many times is it going to take to get this ready. Anyway, that's the first one. It kind of does spin off. Like if I was going to seriously do this, this is kind of more done as like an episode. I probably would, <coughs> would look into. Oh, clutch! Yeah, she finished the course. I'm really happy with that. Finishing about 12.5. It's actually pretty nippy. Uh, for a Zook that kind of spun out, that is still a pretty decent time of 12.5 seconds. It's not my fastest time doing this with a Zook. I think my fastest Zook did this in about 7.8 and I'm pretty sure there are people which have got faster. But that's a pretty decent time and I'm happy with it nonetheless. Uh, with that being said, I'm going to save this before I lose my marbles. This Zook can be used in any of the other modes including the simulator which I may well do at some point to showcase some of this, these Zook's abilities against some of my other Zooks. How about we quickly try out the new Zook that we made, Cupid's Arrow, against some of my other Zooks. So there's Cupid's Arrow, and let's try it up against... Oh. How about we try it up against this guy that I call Traffic Lights, and let's see how he does. So we're going to try out in Dodgy Zook, Zook Hurdles, Zook Marbles, and Zook Smash, because they tend to be more focused around about speed rather than like strength. Anyway, let's go. Uh, I am half expecting that my super quick Zook will be very efficient here. It is also slightly thinner overall, so it should have no problem skating through, which it currently has no problems. Um, this is Paul, so you can make your Zooks do different competitions as well. This is uh, Cupid's Arrow. Oh, he's kind of going to go around it. That's pretty good. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful turning speed, and he's going to comfortably win this from traffic lights who is still stuck over there 
Um, as you can see, he's having a bit of trouble getting around some of these. And he's finally getting around them now, but he's got hit by that last one. He finally made it round. Well done him. Uh, but how about we try out some other contests, shall we? Um, let's now try that Zook Hurdles. Um, I'm half expecting this to be another win for Cupid's Arrow. I think Cupid's Arrow is slightly faster than Traffic Lights overall. But let's see if I'm right on this fact. Um, yeah, Cupid's Arrow has got a little bit of a head start. But he is having, he's now having a fight with Traffic Lights. Traffic Lights now... Oh, and it missed its cycle. That means Traffic Lights is going to win this quite comfortably. Yeah, Traffic Lights did win this quite comfortably. Uh, oh, as I can see, this uh, the the other Zook has made it past, and it was doing it would do so well. It just kind of oh no, it got stuck on there. It got stuck on the last bit. It's kind of oh, it kind of did that, but it kind of lost anyway. Uh, it kind of crashed. If you haven't realised what happened, that that bit crashed. Time for Zook Marbles. Um, this should be kind of interesting. I'm half expecting that Cupid's arrow is going to be a lot quicker and plus its shape is going to help plough through all the marbles. But we shall see. It's certainly starting out really strong. It's pushing. It's kind of a head. Is it head? No, I think it's gone on one side. Oh man, traffic light wins. Oh, oh, that's a shame. That is a shame. And now it's doing a dance. It doesn't want to go off. I suppose that's pretty cool. It's going to get hit soon, but yeah, that's the thing. But yeah, that's a pretty impressive win for Traffic Lights, but I'm kind of disappointed because I thought he Cupid's Arrow would do it. Uh, let's do Zook Smash for the hell of it. And hopefully, like, Cupid's Arrow will be able to redeem itself here because it has lost the last two distance. It is a much faster Zook, as you can see, but it's just not doing anything here. Oh, oh no, no, but Traffic Light is interfering with it. It's like so powerful. It's just like... Yeah, we see the strength is kind of doing its thing, and it's kind of won three out of four disciplines purely on strength alone. Well, but that's kind of a cool glitch at the end of that. Yeah, but as you can see, this suit is pretty nimble and pretty quick. Anyway, I'm kind of glad you were able to see some of the stuff that this suit can do. Now back to the suit kit. If you would like uh, to download this kit, I'll, it, that link for the Discord will be in the description. It contains links to this suit kit along with many other features that you'll be able to experience for yourself throughout in your own spare time. Until that time comes, my name's been Robotic Master and this is me signing off.